SEMA 2009. The cars, the parts, the experience. Nobody brings it to you like Power TV. The internal components of your engine are a great factor in reliability and horsepower, and JE Pistons has a great reliable piston that they're introducing here at the 2009 SEMA show. Alan Stevenson is with us. Tell us about this new line of piston. We're really excited about this new line. It's our SRP Professional. Uh, the impetus behind this line is that we've been going for a long time, about 10, 15 years, uh, on old technology. And now the new technology is here in the form of the SRP Professional. We've got skirt coatings on these. We've uh, been able to achieve at least a 10% weight reduction on each and every component in there, some of them as much as 80 grams. Uh, we've put a, a new ring package, which is a metric ring package, and. Uh, uh, 1.2, 1.5, and 3 millimeters, which, by the way, is the same ring package that is used on the LS7 from the factory. Uh, some of the different materials that we've put in there will really help on the reliability of it and the durability. So uh, we're very happy with the overall package, great value. What is the coating meant to do for the piston? The skirt coating is really something that can serve two purposes. It's an anti-friction coating for one. Uh, the other thing is that uh, it could help you in a, in a situation where you uh, overheat the engine. Let's say you're running in a circle track race, you're three laps from the end, and a radiator hose breaks. The thing starts heating up, everything starts expanding. That skirt coating gives you a little bit of extra insurance to make sure you're not going to gall those pistons or, or run into a seizure problem at the final lap. So, And what about the ring material you're now adding to the piston? Yeah, the ring material is a huge step. That's probably the biggest story here. Uh, Traditionally, when you're looking at this price point of, uh, of pistons, you'll see either a cast iron ring or maybe a ductile iron plasma molly style ring. We've gone completely beyond that with this ring package here. It's, it's a carbon steel top ring, which anybody that knows about metals knows that carbon steel is many, many times better than uh, either cast iron or ductile iron. Uh, plus, there's no molly channel that could chip out as you, uh, as you have with the older style rings. Uh, these are a plasma nitrided ring and the wear resistance on plasma nitrided is about 60% better than on a traditional plasma molly. Now this series of pistons is meant to do both street performance and racing type applications? Absolutely. I mean more and more of the OEMs are going to this style of ring. More and more OEMs are going to steel rings and to nitrided uh, finishes on them because they understand the, the, the durability and uh, the friction benefits that you get from those. So we're really pulling some from some of the OEM technology and we're the first ones really in the aftermarket to make it a standard in our aftermarket line. When you talk about value for this product, what are we talking about in terms of cost for a set of pistons? You know, the cost on the set of pistons, if people are used to buying a traditional set of SRPs with a, with a let's say, a sportsman-style plasma molly ring package, you're going to have the same price point on these within about $20 for the whole set. So, I, you know, they start out on a retail basis at, at somewhere around uh, $575, including the rings, the carbon steel wrist pins, uh, the whole package, coated and everything. Now, Alan, aside from the domestic application, you have a specific piston that will fit the Subaru engine. We do. This is something else we're very excited to unveil here at the SEMA show. Uh, this is the world's first all truly billet piston for the Subaru STI uh, EJ257 engine. And uh, if, if anybody has the chance to look this thing up on our website or come by the booth either here at PRI to take a look at this thing, it's just a work of art. Our engineers did an amazing job with this. Um, we specifically des developed this, uh, this new billet piston for the uh, Ken Block Gymkhana car and also in conjunction with uh, Crawford Performance for their Time Attack car. Uh, it's made for the Subaru STI engine, the EJ257, up to 1,200 horsepower. Looking for a good product for your street performer or race car, jepistons.com is the place to go to.